Eat. You're a professional vegan right now. I'm an amateur meat eater. I love eggs. I'm not asking beef. you. I love liver. I'm I asking think, you, are you I against the exploitation animal of animals? You're describing you, the farm that you've been told when you're three. There's way more important things going on right now the, than if the if the pig cries. The, mate, exists. all right. Do you want to go down history or do you want to go down religion? I'll be going down into the gas. We're going to get caught. I eat a lot of minced beef, and a lot of liver, and a lot of eggs, and a lot of butter, and I'm feeling great. Right, what great about your ethics? Great. I want to talk ethics. Talk to me. Right, so what, are you, are you against animal abuse? Um, depends how you define animal abuse, but how overall, do you yes. How do you define it? I think animal abuse is, is not ideal. No, the um, definition, what's the definition of abuse to you? Being consciously cruel to an animal. Being, consciously being, per to animal. being purposefully cruel to an animal. I would define it as uh, unnecessary mental or physical suffering. In, in, inflicting any mental yeah. or physical suffering on, on another being, right? Well, I think, it's per I think it's purposeful or whether it's conscious or unconscious, it's you're letting it happen, you're doing it. You know, right. So, to it. so we agree that we're both against that. Yes. Right. So how are you justifying that happening to animals for your taste pleasure? If you're it's against it. My, it's not for my taste pleasure. What's it for? I'd argue that animal eating, eating animals and eating animal products has been an essential part of our development as a species. And if you look historically into the development of humans, you cannot take away meat and think that we'd be in the same place right now. Your ancestors throughout history ate meat as right. well as other things. I'm not saying that, of course, we've had, a, we've had many different things on our diet. But meat has been, meat, animal products, eggs, Organs, everything, all of these good stuff. Right. But done in the old fashioned way where you're hunting and it's right. not the modern ways. Which I understand we can what you're saying. But understand that's been an saying. essential part. That's been an essential part to how we have developed as a species. And if you were to take away, if you were to say, oh, we're meant to be vegan, we're meant to be vegan, and right. uh, historically all our ancestors should have been vegan, mate, we wouldn't be here. That right. building wouldn't be built. We wouldn't have these clothes. We wouldn't right. be alive. We'd probably right. be dead. Let me, let me just... Sorry, let me just dead if we were all vegans, man. Let me just respond to that, right? Please, yeah, yeah. yeah. So you're talking about evolution. Yeah. You're, you're talking about evolution yeah. and we've evolved, right? Yeah. So the, the key part is the continual evolution. So yeah. back in the day when we had to survive and, the, and we had to perhaps hunt and gather to survive is a lot different to now when you have options, all right? So the key part is to continue to evolve. Now, the Academy of Nutrition and Diastetics has proven that a whole food plant-based diet is optimal for all stages of life, including pregnancy. So evolution, right? So we've continued to evolve. Yeah. So now we should evolve past the point of having to exploit animals when we don't need to. It's been scientifically proven that we do not need to eat animals okay. whatsoever so or secretions from animals. What's your opinion? What's your opinion about... Essentially, we don't. I don't think we have enough room on this earth, on this planet, to feed people with enough of what we need. Plant-based, like animals, provide a lot of high calorie density, high nutrition density. Right. And so the way we're established, the way the world is established, we cannot take away meat. We will collapse. Let me debunk you, that for you. Do you know how we will? Let me debunk that for you. I could debunk this for you really quickly. Like there wouldn't be enough beans, nah. babe. I could debunk I'm this sorry, super fast. I can debunk this super fast. <laughs> how many animals? <laughs> how many animals are bred? Land animals are bred into existence every year. Mate, you got these stats, not me. All right, I'll tell you, it's 80 billion. How many humans are on this planet? Seven, eight, eight billion. billion. Yeah. So we grow enough crops. We grow enough feed to feed 80 billion land animals. We then slaughter them okay. and feed them to 8 billion okay. humans. Let's so, just, let's, wait, 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 let me finish. Yeah, yeah, please, yeah. If we didn't breed 80 billion land animals into existence, yeah. we could reuse over 74% of our land that we currently use to farm animals to feed everybody. Okay, but let, let's... But think, I have to yeah. stress. Yeah, yeah, cool. These are just environmental logistics and they're not addressing the actual injustice to the individual. Because if you it's were the also, individual, it's you wouldn't accept this. It's, we've, got ha we've got to be practical. It's only a privileged society which can start discussing ethics and morals, which I think so is I'm important. This is what I'm talking also, to you. as a practical way, if you were just like, let's be vegans. So this is, I'm talking you to you. realise the world cannot, cannot transform like that. It's not possible. It's not going to just splash overnight. The population would need to decline by a lot if no. we were all vegans. No, no, and it wouldn't. You, and you think about, That's wrong. Where's your, where's your proof of that? Think about cow. You've got no proof of that. And look, you're wrong, because your stats are wrong. You didn't even know how many animals were brought into existence. Look, mate, 
I'm the stats are I haven't come into town today thinking I'm going to have a debate around me and not wait. I haven't yeah, got but, my stats list from. But Wikipedia. I do. I can tell you I, it. I appreciate I can tell that. You it. You're a prepared man because you come here for that purpose. But, but I want to talk about, about the individuals. Think about cows. Think cows. about. Oh, let's talk about think cows. About cows. They eat grass. Yeah. Loads of grass. Yeah. They eat grass-fed cows are some of the healthiest, best cows you can have. Right. Cows don't just they, eat grass. They eat grass. No. Nope. Great. No. Nope. And then. No. Nope. What, what do they eat in the winter? Look, I'm sure they eat something else, hay yeah. and whatever, but. They Look, don't see grass. Cows, you, you've fallen into the propaganda you've the, been fed. The important thing is that cow can transform grass, which we cannot no. eat, have no nutritional benefit to. You're wrong. You're it, wrong. Uh, on all, they're, you, they're I know what you're talking about. You're talking about calorie cow. deficit per pound on no, this, it, and you're it, wrong. No, it becomes a cow. That grass and that plant, which is useless to us, doesn't give any nutrition to us. That then turns into a beautiful animal with various different organs, which are incredibly good for you and nutritionally dense. And so we literally go from sun no. plus grass equals beautiful, loving, nurturing, no, you're wrong. nutritionally it's... fed cow. Mate, which you're, we making can then a, eat. you're making yourself look a bit silly, mate, because I'm you're literally because you're describing you... the farm that you've been told when you're three. Look, that doesn't happen. Look, bro, do you think but we you... should all eat plants and grass, you... mate? There's so much well, more. Vegans don't eat grass. There's more nutrition. I don't eat grass. There's more nutrition in the cow. I don't eat grass. Is I don't eat grass. I'm strong. I eat beef. I'm twice your size, mate. Yeah, I'm twice your size and I eat grass. You're also more than twice my age, so you've got more time to build that. Do it. Look, the fact is, yang, we've know, gone I mean. well away from the actual subject, right? Because we're talking about nutrition, yeah. we're talking about health, yeah. health yeah, yeah, benefits. Yeah, yeah. You I don't care about know, any of that, yeah? You care about the ethics and morals first. Is that been, what you're saying? Listen, yeah? the health and the benefits and, and our side of it has been scientifically proven. Look up the... Also, listen, let me, proven the let me yeah. finish a sentence. Let me finish a sentence. The Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, which is over 107 studies on the human body and a vegan diet, it's been proven that it's optimal. So the science is there. We don't need to discuss science. But when we look at ethics, I want to know where your ethics lay. You want to join? <laughs> where do your ethics lay in the exploitation, rape, kidnap, and murder of sentient beings for what essentially comes down to your taste pleasure? Um, I would like to say that I'm not, but how am I involved with any of that? Because you're I'm paying not, for it. So all of these industries are supply and demand industries. So every time you buy a litre of cow's milk, you're effectively voting for someone to rape a mother cow, kidnap her baby, if it's male, slit his throat, and if it's female, she goes into a holding pen for around six months, and then she comes out and she joins the back of the dairy line to be exploited for the milk that was intended for her calf. You're paying yeah. for that system. Do you understand you're yeah, paying no, for that I system? Understand how so that's how I you, understand how economics works. So that's how you're but contributing. As a conscious person who I choose to have animal products I try and get my products from organic farm sources they do the same they do the same organic Look, farms do I'm the sure same they're similar they're I'm not sure they're they similar. do the same they're exactly the same but the only how what does a cow yeah. produce milk well because because it, it, it in some way it feeds the animal kingdom mate no no, no. It, 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 that's mate, young you can't say the cows produce milk because in some way they feed the animal well, kingdom yeah. a cow produces milk because she's a mum because they give birth to the calf and how how the do they calf, get pregnant? And the calves grow. How do they get pregnant? Mate, I know, look, I how? know you're going to... I know how they get pregnant. You get how? a bastard, based her up there and you fucking shoot her up So they rape her? They rape her? That's yeah. her bodily autonomy, yeah. uh, autonomy oh, being God, completely God. taken it's away. It's about veganism, etc. But do you understand that it's a very privileged society to be nope. able to talk about these issues? No. Nope. Because what's happening, nope. what's happening in this world You're deflecting. Right now, you're deflecting. No. You're deflecting. You haven't given I'm me debating. your point. You haven't I'm given me your point, but you've not. Things. You're going away from it. I want to know yeah, your, is, I want to know your position on great, the ethics of this that. This is a great example. You're armed with stats and this and that and that. You're ready for this today. I don't need stats. Mate, I just need I to know if you're against animal abuse. You don't need stats for that. Look, are you I against love, the exploitation of animals? I love eggs. I'm not asking beef. you. I love liver. I'm I asking you, are you I against the exploitation animal products, of animals? Animal products are incredible. And what about, very, what about the industries that exploit them? I think the industries need to be worked on like every other industry. Why? But what other industries are out here, mate? There's so many other issues that are happening in other industries. In that shop right now, do you know how many chemicals are sold in that boots shop? Oh, are you, mate, why are you, why are you protesting mate, you're, that? You're the biggest deflector because yeah, 80 talk, billion individuals are slaughtered I'm every year like to feed here. people who are naive to the fact that there is someone suffering. There is, they're having a it's subjective a, experience an animal, of their mate. life. Okay. It's, it's an, an animal. animal. What's that supposed to mean? It mean? We, as humans, have higher levels of consciousness and awareness than animals. What about a human who's mentally impaired, who has the same cognitive ability as a pig? Or a cow, or a chicken. <laughs> these all Should we exploit them? We don't understand the diff. Like the diff there's a difference between an animal. What's yes, the they difference? have feelings. Yes, What's they the have. A, yes, they have a spirit, right? So they have feelings and they have a spirit. So why? Yeah. How are you justifying exploiting them for your taste? 
It's not for my taste, mate. It's for my well-being. No. It's, science it's has proven diet. that. Science has proven that. No, there's... there's there science has proven it. No, science has proven a few things. Science has proven some it. It's, it's ironclad. It's some done. researchers would say vegan is a great diet, the perfect diet. Others would say carnival, perfect diet, great diet. There's yeah, different research look at, depending look on, at the on, sources. on the researchers. This mate, is why I'm telling you, you the Academy get, of Nutrition and Dietetics are the I biggest. Think, They're the most well-renowned, sure, the most I'm respected. Sure you will say that, okay? But go and, go and research also, it. Also, I'm giving you, I'm prepared. giving you the studies yeah, to go and check out, that. right? Yeah, yeah. So let's let's say the science. Let's say when you research the science, the science proves to you that you can be optimally healthy, right? Let's say the science is there. Where's your ethics? What do you mean? Take the science away. Let's say that you go away from today. You look at the papers on the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, and you go, oh, that guy was right, what he was saying. So I'm... the science is there. Where's your ethics on these animals being exploited and murdered for think, taste pleasure? Because that's should, what it would come down to. I think we should work on it. I think just like Do you not think we should just stop it? No, I think this is an issue, like many other issues in the world, that we need to work on. And I, I think rather than saying you or us, me or you, it's a how do we come together and find a solution and get progress in the right direction. Because I'm not going to stop eating animal the, products. The only solution well, to this would, is would, everybody taking personal accountability. Yeah. You need to take personal accountability because you are personally responsible for that. It, this, not, they're, they're, that I'm blood not, is on your hand, 100%. I, I, look, if you're not vegan and you're paying it's, for it's, that, it's, it's, it's that's like on your, your hands. This is a really vegan thing to say, oh my God, you're, this is your fault and you're, you know... But how are you, so how are you removing me. yourself from it? How are, you, how are you removing yourself from it? Because you're I, paying I'm for it. I'm responsible about where I get my stuff from. But the, where you get I your stuff from to is increase these places. See that bin there? That bin there is from Norfolk Free Range. Okay, in Norfolk, it's a pig farm, it's a free range pig farm that is organic, free range, and they actually got awards. This guy has got like the, the farmer yeah, award no. of the year, and this is the there's, organic free range that they tell you. There's things going on, Matt. There's a lot of things going on. But you're paying for that. You're paying for that. Yeah, Even you if you look at I'm the most for, closest things, you're paying you for pay, this. You could say I'm paying for a lot of things by, the, by partaking in this society. Like you're you're partaking in child labour. It's like, oh yeah, you are technically. You don't know that. You, really, you don't know that. Look, ninety percent of clothes we wear, just no. like just like food, I'll say, I appreciate that point. Food comes from dirty places, dirty industries. We're living in the time of a lot of dirty industries. So I'm not saying the industry is clean. All I'm saying is there's a nuanced argument here. It's not black and white. It is for them. Well, I'm it's sure life, it's I'm life sure, and death for I'm them. I'm sure you would say that. If but you also, if you were them, not, how would you feel, mate? Well, they're dead, so that's no. how they feel. If you, if you were they're, this they're piglet... In, they're in piggy heaven now. This you know, piglet this you know, piglet here, right? Do you, believe in, do you believe in another place, another world, another spirit? That's irrelevant. Well, no, it's not. My, my belief no, on, on that's irrelevant. It's not, because what, what, what's your belief about when that pig dies? What happens? Well, that's got nothing to do with what well, happens no, to them no, while they're on the planet. It does, because what happens after <laughs> demonstrates if it was a bad thing that happened or not. If you believe that things carry on, if someone dying. Right, all right. Dying, so if I believe in it, heaven, it's okay to absolutly exploit these animals, is, give them no. the worst life, then put them in a gas chamber, then slash their throat and put them into boiling water because I believe they're going to go to that's a better good, place. Mate. So yeah. I'm doing them a favour. It's not. That's not moral. That's not ethical. Sure. But you support that. Look, you are funding that daily. <laughs> you are funding that daily. If you're not vegan, you're paying for that every single day. Mate, if you look at the most organic, free-range, best of the best, RSPCA assured, red tractor assured, you put all the labels on it you want. There's a lot of corruption in the industry. I'll, I'll so why that. would you not boycott it? Because I don't want to. Why? Because I believe that I evolve and live best with food. Science has with proven... animal-based Science has proven... There's the different other arguments argument. and there is different debates which show that a vegan diet is no, great for some people. The way you're justifying this is I believe. No, you're saying I believe. I could say I yeah, believe that it's okay to rape people because I think it's all right. Personal responsibility, right? I'm having personal responsibility for my beliefs. So but you're not taking views, responsibility. And I'm not... No, but I am. Because I'm when I'm buying that beef, I'm appreciating I'm buying the beef. Great. But a rapist that's, could say, when I rape that lady, I'm appreciating mate, that lady. That's so crass. That's so, so crude. They're both mate. injustices. What are you trying to achieve here? Are you trying to convert people to veganism? What, 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 we're standing what up you, for animals. What, what have you come here to do? We're standing up is, for animals against tell people. Me, tell me about your purpose here and what you're looking to achieve. So, first and foremost today, we're exposing the RSPCA. Because yeah. like you, you're saying, I look for my responsibly, res uh, uh, responsibly sourced animals. Yeah. RSPCA assure this. The RSPCA assure gas chambers. The RSPCA assure macerators for male chicks, which is an open blender, by the way. If they're born male, they just throw them into an open blender. So we're here today exposing these industries, yeah. first and foremost. 
then we're standing up for these animals because people yeah. like you think I have to eat animals to be healthy when you don't. People like you think I can responsibly hurt animals when you can't. So we're here fighting for them, raising awareness because good people are paying for bad things when they don't even realize it. You may never have seen this before. So I can't put my finger at you and say you're a bad person. But what I can say is you're probably uneducated in this. And if you care about animals, I urge you massively to educate yourself on this because you would be horrified to know what you're paying for. Yeah, look, exposing a lot of issues. This, this thing, this problem is, and I appreciate that you guys out here have chosen your issue and you want to tackle that issue. That's how issues, that's how progress happens, right? But I, in my opinion, in my view, there's many other issues. Especially Mate, there's humani a hundred different humanitarian issues, issues Look, which I would focus on as opposed to this. But I appreciate this is your mission, this is your purpose. That's fine. There's, in my opinion, there's way more important things going on right now Look, than if the if the pig cries. There's a hundred different I'm, I'm issues, sorry, but, but I you think don't there focus is. on one issue at once. Well, just because I'm focusing on do. animal rights doesn't mean I become a racist because I don't care about no, racism. Of course not. So what I mean, not. what what I'm saying is, not. you can still stop contributing to the biggest animal injustice that there ever has been and still focus on your other issues. This is a, the, a base level issue. You just don't pay for it. What it's about simple. this time to be vegan? It takes yeah. no more time to be vegan than non-vegan. So yeah. you can be vegan while caring about all these other issues. Yeah. That's great. Um, that's great. So I don't know what, where we're going with this conversation, by so, the way. So what would stop you being vegan? If you're against animal abuse, which you said you was, you want to reduce harm, which you said that's your standpoint, what would stop you from actually taking personal accountability and saying, yeah, I'm going to stop paying for this. I'm going to stop funding these industries. Why would I put myself at a nutritional deficit? You're not. For me personally. You're not. But I, that's your me, anecdotal for, opinion. That's not science. Yeah, but it's also my. It's also. It's also <laughs> my. It's also pers It's also my personal choice. Like we're saying, right? What about so, their personal choice? Your yeah. personal choice as a victim. You're personally choosing to put Do them in a gas chamber. Do you think about vegans? Everyone looks a bit grim right now. Sure. Do you think I'm a bad person? I think I think if you take Everyone this information, looks, so you look really sad. You look really sad. You look really grim. Like, it's like you look upset. Are you happy to be like doing this? Is there like any fulfillment going on? We don't here? want to come out and do this. Like, we want this to end. We're okay. doing this because it's do you the right thing it's to not do. Gonna end? Do you realize this is never going to end? Do you do you appreciate I think that we need? On the if, contrary, if you, do you realize if, that this if will you end? To say, if you were to wave a magic wand and say, "Don't, no one is eating meat ever again." Do you realise that the population would collapse? Do you appreciate no, I wouldn't. that? No, I wouldn't. We well, it have would. Well, it would. Do you, yeah. do you, do you, look. Pardon? Okay, tell me what. Tell me. Listen, veganism is going to happen like this. What? Look, look at me. Look at me. Veganism is going to happen like this. I had a trend, and now it's crashing and burning. No, it's not. Realizes that. No, it's the, not. The look at the true way, statistics. The natural way of being, the actual way, no. the best optimum health no. is to have animal products in our life, Mate, but look, high look quality this, animal why, products. Why would you why, look, look at this Stop using one person as. Oh, the the vegan vegan must be good. No, <laughs> like, but you're maybe, using. Relax. Like, it's you're using. Examples, you're using your you're anecdotal opinion. There's loads of other examples where can say, oh, look, it's great. I'm not going to do that as a silly example. These are not unhealthy people. What we're saying is... If, if we, yeah, that's if great, we because all the I, think, I think... Why can't you? That's what we're saying. But why do you think that's your... Why do you think it's your... Your job to stand here and tell me what I should eat and not? But I would say, why do you think it's your right what, to cut animals? No, but why do you why do you have the audacity to think because to tell me what to do? To because tell we're me speaking what up for the victims. I'm not telling you, you have to eat me. No, 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 you're telling me and you're trying to tell me what to do. There's many things you shouldn't against. tell people what to do. What we're doing, mate, we're standing up here for the animals, right? I'm not yeah. standing here saying to you, you can't eat meat. Yeah. I'm standing here for humans. Yeah. What I'm saying to you is, if you educate yourself and then continue to fund these industries, yeah. that's quite bad. You have a choice. Yeah. No one is, yeah. no nice. one is, nice. if you feel guilty, that's because you no, might have a conscience. No, you're trying to guilt trip me. No, I'm trying but to stand up for I'm, animals I'm against people like you. I'm not saying you're a bad me, person. Yeah. I'm you not saying you're a bad, if you knowingly pay for this, <laughs> what does that make you? I'm not saying you're a bad person, but I'm saying if you knowingly pay to put six months old pigs in gas chambers, how does that sit with you? That shouldn't happen. I agree. We agree we should, on that. Yeah, we shouldn't have right? that. We agree on and that. We should, make, we should make inroads to making better standards in the food industry as a whole, but listen, including, the, including the treatment of animals. There is no right so, way to do the wrong thing. We can't well, do there it. there is. We, we can't. Historically, you raise a cow. 
You're on the farm. You, you, this is the family cow. You're describing no. the three-year-old storybook. That, we don't need to. What I'm describing is the right way to do a right thing. It's the wrong thing. Because the dairy cow is rape, what do kidnap, you say, what torture do you say, and murder. What do you say about your ancestors who... Every You're talking ancestor, in the past, mate. No, Look into the future. You learn from the past. You learn from the... Look. No, a lot. You learn from. You learn Lots from of the bad past, things happened and they teach in the past. You lessons from, to, from I'm the future, with you. Right? Learn from the past. We yeah. have learned. Yeah. This is what an we injustice. Learn from the past? When you have animal products, it's very good for you. It's an injustice. It, it we don't need population. it. Increases population. It, like we're literally. Listen. All right. Product. Let me use your same logic. We're let me use your same logic, and I'll show you why it's flawed. He wouldn't be here. I understand what you're saying, but let me use your logic, and I'll show you why it's flawed. Why do chickens exist if they have not many to be eaten? Hold up. Because you're flying off. Not, why are cows let me, created by God if they're not meant to be eaten? Let me use why? the same logic. Why are these products? Because you've here? now brought up religion. Why? I'll come back to religion. Why are these animals? But let's start put with your first if point. They were not here to sustain us and give us sustenance. What one do you want to go down? Do you want to go? All right. Right. Mate, exists. all right. Do you want to go down history or do you want to go down religion? Which one do you want to go down? Mate, just talk. Just all right. Whatever's on You're your, saying your history. Conscience. Right, you're saying history, history, history. In history, it was more beneficial for us to have slaves because we got more done. Therefore, with your own reason of thinking, we should bring back slavery because we get more done. If you want to go down religion, what religion are you? What's uh, your I faith? I don't have a religion, mate. But you're talking about religion. You yeah. said God put animals here to eat. Yeah. So is that your faith or is it, are you just trying out things in the Bible? Yeah, but I don't have a religion, mate. But you believe, so that, that's completely- Religion, that's, religion, is, a, it, religion is dogma. I have I have faith and so we can't we can't that. debate over faith. Call it that. But but so then there's no point debating over a specific faith if you haven't got a belief in that faith. So there's no point well, discussing I that. Well, I think well it is because just just because I don't have an identity that I. All right, so let's go with this way because you can't tell me your faith. Okay, what I can tell you is that there's no I religious told you my book. Faith, mate. <laughs> there is no religious book that says you must eat meat. There's not one. Okay. There's so, not one. So therefore, in every religion, it it's your is choice. Assumed, because it is such an innate, yeah, natural totally. thing, just like a lion looks at a uh, deer. They you think didn't that say lions, food. man. Did you that say lions? Lion mate, you don't, you're not a lion, mate. You don't need to teach you. You're not a lion, you mate. You eat veg, bro. You're not a lion. So, like, calm down, you're not a lion. Um, well, I'm not trying to justify rape, murder and gas chambers by, with By comparison, lions. you're a rabbit, yeah? You're, I'm a rabbit? Yeah, by comparison, if we're making those, if we're talking about what animal we are, you're a rabbit. Bro. All right, I'll let you go with this, mate. This will be good yeah. content. All right. It's like a gorilla than a, than a rabbit. Look at him. He's a all right. gorilla. All right. Yeah, so yeah. go on, mate. Lions. Well, no, we weren't talking about that. You just said lions. You brought up lions, though. You were going yeah, to go along nature say, you were and saying, lions. You were saying there's no religious book that says to teach to, to eat meat. That's because it is such a natural instinct. It is such a natural thing as a all human right. being Hold to there. gain sustenance. If from I took animals. a child, if I took a child, let's say a five year old child, I put them in a room with an apple and a chicken. Do you reckon that that five-year-old child naturally, instinctively, would eat the apple and pet the chicken? Or do you think it would cuddle the apple and break the chicken's neck and start tearing into his body? Mate, firstly, kids are not the ones responsible. They don't, they don't have... That is the most, that is the most innocent form of nature. Kids. They've not been conditioned. They've not been affected. They've who not been... Who picked the apple? Was it the kid that didn't reach the tree? No, it was an adult. Just the same thing with the chicken. Does a child oh, you kill should the be chicken? A politician, does mate. You're so slippery. Look, does a child, You're not answering my question. Does a child pick up the apple? No. Does a child kill the chicken? No. It's offered the food by the responsible adult who understands mate. these things better. They're offered a meal. They, they All right, let's go another approach of nature. Lions. If a lion has a baby and that baby is dis disfigured, they eat meat, disformed, by the way, just right? Saying, yeah, yeah. They eat meat. Let's say this mother lion that she has a, her cubs. If one is born um, yeah. like disabled. She will kill that cub because it weakens the the pride. The pack, yeah. Right. So pride, yeah. let's say so humans do that. If we have a child with with uh, additional needs, would we take that same approach? Historically, which is obviously uh, your oh, history, bro. You're going on nature. No, I'm saying there's you're there's going some on nature. Civilizations that did do that. But nature in isn't evil. If you want to go down nature, lions rape each other. There's good and bad. You're justifying nature. rape because lions in nature, rape. Nature, there's the good and the bad. But that's, you're justifying that's the of you're life. justifying your bad with the good of nature. You no, can't do I'm that. I'm understanding that in life there is good and bad. And in, in, just like there's, there's bad in your good and there's good in your bad and the same with me. That's just a fact of life. You could find, I could find right now, if I was to like, oh, think, do a study, I could come up with loads of arguments and loads of things about how you're supporting bad things because there's always something bad in the good, but there's always good in the bad as well. And that's why I'm, I'm at peace, my friend.
with what my decisions are. You're all over the place, mate. You, not, you're, you're all over the place. I'm You've not, got no consistency with your morals or your ethics. Well, I do. What you do is you <laughs> cherry pick from each one to fit your narrative. No, you, you come if here you with, want to do it, then you'll find a way to try and justify it with vegan. some... Yeah, you're a professional you're, vegan. You're a professional vegan, right? I'm, I'm vegan, not, mate. I'm a vegan. There's no, no professional you're, vegans. No, you're just you vegans. You're a professional vegan. You are researched, you have arguments, you've debate, you've had many debates before. You've obviously gone on your journey and you've got a lot of information. You are a professional vegan. I wouldn't you're call myself a professional let's, vegan. Let's, say right, let's go, all right. This debate right here. Yeah. Let's say you're a professional vegan right now. I'm an amateur meat eater. Like, I don't, I don't have, this is not my career, it's not my purpose, it's not my thing. If you get in the ring and amateur, amateur boxer against a professional boxer, mate, is your, the debate is always going to look like you're going to win because you're the professional. You're born that prepared. Mate, the reason why you're it looks like that. Here. You are the one Listen, the reason why it looks like that, mate, is because... I saw what's going on and then we just had a chat. The reason so why it looks like that... It's easy to make it look like I am wrong and you're right. It's you're, not because of that, mate. Your arguments and your information your, and your studies. It's not because but of that. It's because you, it's if basic if fundamental rights. It's so easy. It's, basic. it's not complex. Innocent if, sentient beings okay. being exploited okay. for a sensory pleasure. Okay. It's so simple. I don't have to it's be a genius. Mode. I haven't got to have a PhD a to, to make me okay. eaters look silly when they're if, trying to justify nature, religion, taste. If, if you were living, let's say you, had, you were just out in the wilderness, mate, and you had your oh, family. Don't, 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 do don't, don't do it, mate. Don't do it, mate. There's a deer. Right. There's a deer over there. Right. Your family is starving. All I'm trying to do you a favour. Don't go down this road. You've got seeds. All right. Yeah. You want to keep going? All right. You, all you've got is seeds. Yeah. yeah. There's a deer there. Yeah. If you kill that deer, yeah. your whole family survives. Right. For months. All right, mate. I'm on a desert island with you. What do you do? And it's just you me and you. Desert island. You're eating seeds. I find a nice bit of meat. I'm living longer, mate. If I'm on a desert island, just me and you. Just me and you on a desert island, yeah? Yeah. I'd kill you and eat you and I could justify it. And I, what I can't do is you I can't then walk into Tesco's and go, hey, I thought that me and this you guy was on a desert out. island and I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this guy and eat him. So therefore, I'm gonna continue to contribute towards the rape, murder and exploitation of innocent animals. We're on a desert island, mate. Where does that come into play? Because you're putting a desert island in the middle of Tesco's where you have choices. You're putting a weird scenario that's never probably gonna happen and then trying to justify paying for torture and murder because in a certain situation, this might happen. People have eaten people in these situations to survive. We're not there anymore, mate. We've evolved. We've yeah, come we on a long way. We have the evolved. science knows it. We, have the we know ethically and morally. All of you, all of you here are privileged because your ancestors ate meat. It's not because of it. Every single one of your ancestors ate meat, ate animal products. You now have the, pr the privilege of choice. Hey, he's got it. You got it. You yeah, got it, bro. Choice. You have now got the privilege it's of choice. Only, it's only been established by the previous people. Who, right. What did they do? They did what they did. But we've you know, evolved. There's a lot of atrocities, right? What we've I'm evolved. Is your your choice is being created by your ancestors who ate what they could to survive. To survive. And, and also he's they, got it. I reckon and, he's just jumping in. And also you're getting there. They, they ate what was nutritionally beneficial for them at the time that's what the allow the population to get where we are so do you understand that even your veganism in the, inside the veganism it's enabled by the meat eating you can't take that away from it but our free no, is. living in a non-fascist country was enabled by us bombing germany we shouldn't bomb germany now should we because we have our freedom now from bombing germany all right that's quite uh I'm, I didn't it's grasp exactly that. the same mate yeah we it's the exact logic now based on things that our ancestors did to give us the freedoms we have today. It's the exact no, no, same logic. We can, we can, we can understand. That's you your can, logic, mate. You can understand He's just the, giving you your logic back you in a under, different scenario. You can understand the inherent value of meat and animals in our history and if in our development. If you realise the inherent value of war when it needed to happen. Yeah. We live free from fascism now because we bombed Germany. But it's I'm the not, exact argue, same thing. I'm arguing we're, face, we're, we're trickling back that. that no, that, no, no. Say. It's, it's, <laughs> mate, it's... <laughs> You've got the past, man. He's got. He's held yeah, a mirror need, up to your sentence and need, just giving you it back. We need. We need to learn from the past. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. We need to Rob, you're getting past. it, mate. Listen. No one here is judging you, mate. We have all been where you're standing right now, right? We have. This is not. This is not a conversion. We've all been. This is not a conversion opportunity. We've all been where you have I been. I will be a meat eater for the rest of my life. But we all said yeah. that. We yeah. all <laughs> We've all said that too, mate. Here's the penny. Mate, no, I, listen, what I'm going to do... It's great I, what you guys are doing. I'll leave you with two you things, mate. For good things. I'll leave you with two things. Yeah. Stand up for good things. I think that the, the truth is always somewhere in the middle. Let I me leave you with two it's things. It's bad though. to polarise. Because we could go on all day, right? Yeah. Two things. Amazon Prime, 
Watch Pignorant, all right? Joey is the first person to expose inside of a gas chamber in the UK, where they wouldn't even let vets that came and checked these slaughterhouses out see inside. He's exposed it, all right? Watch Pignorant and you'll see the truth of free range farms and gas chambers. Secondly, watch Dominion and you'll see the other injustices that happen across all the different animal species, all right? Yeah. Dominion is on YouTube and Pignorant is on Amazon Prime. Mate, it's been fun. Thank you. Thank you for a good Thank chat, you. mate. Yeah. Thank you for a good chat. I appreciate All it. All right, mate. Well, a lot of people won't stop, though. <laughs> so it's good that we I have to have these conversations. I've got to break the gates. Are we going down into the gas? We're going to get caught.